Do you get tired of people asking you what it feels like to be a woman CEO of uh, any company? I you know, I think I was surprised by it because I think when people started asking, it really was a reflection on the auto industry and what people thought of the auto industry. I'd grown up in it and, you know, frankly, I wouldn't be sitting here today as the chairman and CEO if not 20 years ago, people hadn't taken chances on me to develop me. So it was a bit surprising, but, you know, now if I can uh, be a role model for other young girls to pursue engineering careers or pursue math and science, that's a good thing. But you know, it, it is a, a question that gets asked probably more than it should. When you joined General Motors, you graduated from high school, you went to run it at the age of 18, did you ever expect you could rise up, that any woman could rise up to be the CEO at that time? You know, I think uh, no, I had no even vision that that was something that I could achieve. I was studying engineering and, and loved it, so I was looking to pursue a career in engineering. So uh, again, I've had just wonderful opportunities in my career to, as you said, work in so many different areas, great mentors, so I feel very fortunate. When you were announced as a CEO, did you hear from high school classmates who told you they always knew you were terrific and were going to be the CEO? Did you get a lot of that? Or did you find people laughing at your jokes more? What, what happened after you became a CEO? <laughs> Well, uh, you know, I don't think I had any uh, high school uh, classmates that said we knew this was going to happen, but, you know, I have to say there was a, an outreach from people that I hadn't met or talked to in a while um, that were very positive. So it was really heartwarming, all the positive messages that I got from, you know, people that I, my path had crossed with them at some point in our life. So did your children treat you with more respect before, after you got to be CEO or no? Okay, come on, they're kids. No, so no, no, they <laughs> my, okay. my, my son very aptly reminded me uh, last Mother's Day that your most important job is mom. Okay. So.